down or in-state rivals. Okay, okay, I'm a little excited right now. I'm going to be honest with you guys. I cannot stand this team. I cannot stand this fan base. Whenever we beat this team, it makes me pretty happy. I'm going to be honest with you. But last night, in-state rivals, Mississippi State goes down. 86-82, Rebels won by four points last night, and you got to be honest, this game last night was one heck of a game. This is one of the best Ole Miss and State basketball games I have ever seen before. Maybe the best one of all time, to be honest with you, but anyway, this game last night, back and forth the whole entire game, many lead changes, tired of halftime, but just thank goodness. Ole Miss got the win last night, 86-82 over State. But, man, where do they even start? I don't know. I mean, G.G. Murray won heck of a game last night. That dude had over 20 points, over 10 assists. Morrell, once again, we know Morrell, a freaking beast as well, too. That dude had a bunch of buckets for us last night. You know, really the biggest surprise for us offensively last night, you know, T.J. Caldwell. Now, this is a guy, sophomore guard, and he's had a couple, you know, good games before in the past. But um, last night, that man, we needed him to get some buckets and make some big plays. And, you know, Caldwell, another guy, definitely did some pretty good things for us last night. And there are some other guys you can mention for Ole Miss as well, too, but just to save time, we'll move along. I mean, as far as State, I mean, look, you know, their their guard, you know, Hubbard, this is the guy who was committed to Ole Miss, and then back in the summer with the coaching change, Vaughn was short, he changed his mind, uh, decommitted from Ole Miss, went to State. But, man, Hubert, Hubbard, he gave us a couple problems last night, I'll be honest with you. He had a pretty good game, and – they had a couple other guys from state, pretty good game, but guess what? It wasn't enough. It was not enough to take down the Rebels. Not enough. But anyway, man, even uh, defensively, Ole Miss played pretty good as well, too. Ole Miss had a bunch of steals in this matchup, not many turnovers, and there's a bunch of stats and just a bunch of things, you know, you could discuss more in this video, but... Just to keep it short and sweet, I won't go into all those details. But anyway, look, last night, all that matters is the win. That's all that matters. I don't care if this team, I don't care if well, we're from the state. I don't care if state is, you know, 30 and over, 0 and 30. It just makes my day when we take down this team. Cannot stand this team. Cannot stand that fan base. I'm going to be honest with you. But, whoo, man, one heck of a game last night. And we got a pretty tough one Saturday, I'll be honest with you. Uh, we do have another home game, but pretty good, you know, Auburn team uh, coming to Ole Miss Saturday. And, you know, they they beat us pretty bad the last time. You know, they beat us by over, what was it, like 25 points or something last time a couple weeks ago in, in Auburn. Hopefully a completely different story this time. And I know Auburn on the road is a different team. They definitely struggle on the road. So we'll see what happens Saturday. Hopefully Ole Miss can go 2-0 this week in men's basketball. But either way, that's all I have for the video. If you could, just please leave a like, comment, subscribe. If you haven't already, would we'll be appreciated. See y'all next one. Hotty toddy. Go Rebels.